it's your girl Dota. You already know what the deal is. Yeah. Hey, what is going on, DODA gang? It is your girl Dakota here, back with another video, and today we're going to be playing Life is Strange. I'm going to be starting from the beginning, and yes, I sound stuffed because I am. Start a new game. And here we go. Life is Strange is a story based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Oh, The Last of Us. Oh, that's what it is. Let me get you a paper. So surreal. Mostly called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. Time. I'm okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't and white? fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing that at me now. That is a bomb photo that she took. Man, don't Why think Arbus? about what people are gonna say. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by I the I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st torture, century. Right? But I like it old bullshit. school. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Okay, it would take me, like, hours to read all of this. October is our favorite month. Uh, July 10th, she got accepted into Blackwell Academy. August 18th, 
she left from Seattle to go back to Arcadia Bay. August 25th, okay, she's cussing. Uh, September 2nd, uh, she had in the dorm room, I guess. Uh, September 4th, okay, she's cussing again. Um, okay, more cuss words. All right, we're getting out of this journal because she does not know how to stop. What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of their beauty or innocence? Take a selfie. She had a brilliant eye. I would never do so this in class. She could have taken another approach. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, okay, so I don't want to sound stupid. I didn't know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Okay, don't yell at Is me. Is there little. anybody okay. here who knows <laughs> their stuff? Uh, Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Oh, I don't Victoria. like her. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces. Making Sorry, them Max. No more selfies right zone. now. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all I about I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Oh, I was like, what else am I supposed walk. to do? My Aw, oh, hey guys, it. don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Okay. <sighs> All right, let's get out of here and play this game. Okay, okay, if she keeps cussing like this, we're not playing. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Dang. Who buys a camera that's $5,299? Uh-uh. Really Rich people. Photo equipment. God, I'm such a photo nerd. Like seriously, is she literally, is this all about cussing? Come on there. That printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. I could pump out a whole gallery. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Who is this, Kate? Hi, Kate. Oh, hi, Max. Okay, she looks creepy. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. Cup, cup of tea. Uh, I don't want Thanks, <laughs> but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. I'm the nice kind of person, so that's basically me, of course. Take a photo. This game is not what I expected. I like this panoramic view of Blackwell. Everything looks so green and serene. Yeah, this game is very detailed and you have to go to like every single corner to find stuff because you could miss out on something. So. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Ooh, is that the forest I was in though? Hold on. You can never the escape the lighthouse here. 
Is that the last one that? Okay, I'm just going all up behind this desk. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. Okay, he so probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I'm I bet he gets pristine her or interrupt images. Mr. Jefferson. But I still dig my little instant camera. Oh, I can really look at her. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. Oh! I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch-up. Oh, I didn't know you're that was young, a lie. The world <laughs> is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Oh, so it's not gonna let me give it to him. I would have gave it to him, but she obviously doesn't know what she's doing. So cool that we can check these out anytime. The Decisive Moment by Henry Cartier-Bresson. That's rare. Any, this is definitely where cameras go to heaven. Oh man, they have those sweet ultrasonic lenses. And look at that vintage rangefinder. So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. Gives me hope. All right, I think I've looked at everything. Now it's time to go. And she can't run because she's going like literally so slow. Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't good. know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying a hundred. Welcome look to the real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture. Hey. 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 The animation on this is just... She plays it so shy. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. to Taylor and Victoria. There's Taylor, always waiting for Victoria. Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. Locker. It's mine, yay! I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous as usual. Yes, this poster must stop always dead in their tracks. Uh, Stella. Stella is always deep in her nose. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. That's Dana talking to, I think his name is Justin. Dana is on my floor too. She's such an archetypal, gorgeous cheerleader. They must make them in a factory. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Hey, 
Logan or Bowie's buddy? I hate Bowie jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. It looks like she's been gone. Dude, for supposed to be over. Did you see that? That's just literally just was no. Uh uh. I wish October would last forever. So much stuff in this game that don't need a PC. Missed the Poetry Jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. I wonder what actually happened. Okay, the same missing person war is all over the place. Good thing I left my AK at home. Wait, she has an AK. You can never have enough ghosts and skeletons in the hall. They should just call it a sugar machine. Sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar. Okay, there are a lot of halls and I really don't know where to go. So, what if... Okay. The woman's bathroom. Let's go in. To all of you. American girls, it's Empty. Could. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. <sighs> you about to cry? Okay, let's see if we can go into the stall. Oh, I can see myself. This is actually really good. I feel uh, like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Ew, she's Am I going what, crazy? Dude, you know how dirty that is? And you're just putting your hands all over it? That's nasty. <sighs> uh, she's just touching the sink. Just relax. Sorry, Stop so torturing funny. yourself. You have a gift. Oh, see? <gasps> Why would you do that? That was a good picture. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Uh, take the photo, sis. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. What? Okay, he might be a power from a. So what do you want? Got nothing for you. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo hoo, poor little rich. Okay. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. I'm um, pulling out the gun. You know, pulling out. What are you gun. doing? Come oh, on, put oh, that thing down! Ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick Run. of people trying Paper. to control me! Get that gun away oh, from me, psycho! No! Oh my god. Oh my god. Time. How, how can that be? I was in the bathroom. She he shot that poor girl. Reversed. I held up my hand, and then Dude, I was I got back goosebumps. here. I know, but she just reversed time. time. That is so crazy. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. Dude, I got goosebumps. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. You give me an example of a Man, photographer. I cannot believe who this. Captured the human condition in black and white. I just broke my camera. Okay, if I'm crazy. I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh. I did it. Can you give I me actually did it. She can who perfectly a captured the human time machine. Anybody? Bueller. Max. 
Don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Okay, I'm gonna Why take a artists? selfie like last time. Because of her images of hopelessness. When I took my selfie, like Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll notice this for real. Kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point Can I save that her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. She should have just gave the right. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again process, and give him the right answer? Detail in people's... I'm going to remind it so I can do the right answer. Well, Max. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> Yay. The Daguerrean process <laughs> made portraiture <laughs> hugely popular. She's such a mean because girl. Because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can okay. learn more when I you actually the, finish reading the assigned chapters. Go. Max is so far way ahead oh, yeah, of that. I never got to. Every time I try to guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday it's Heroes Contest. Back. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. Okay, so, Stella and run. Melissa, get it together. To Taylor, Thanks. don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Oh, yes, I really wanted to take a picture of that do your again. again. Oh, well. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, every okay, it won't let me run. In class right. is turning in a photo, so I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Ah. Uh. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Please turn in the picture, dude. Turn in the picture. I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. No, Max, I don't, was, I don't, think that was a don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Yeah, thank you. for the competition everybody in class is turning in a photo so you see the dilemma excuse me mr jefferson can i talk to you for a moment yes excuse you no victoria excuse, excuse us. us i'd never let one of photography's future stars okay, avoid can I just give him handing a photo in a picture and done with this? <sighs> i'm on top of it i think john lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans max you're on fire today all the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Alrighty, now let's get out of here. Wait, can I still take a picture of that thing, though? Oh, Alright, anyways. Alright, let's go. Okay, I don't know how to run, and I keep doing that. Because L2 is usually like a run button. I, I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Okay, go. Please, run. please. Okay. I can't tell R2. anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Run, sis, run. Honestly, if I tell the principal. I hate that okay, wait, who is that? I know you didn't nope, I can't even talk to you. Go, 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 go. I won't be bored. It's the men's bathroom. This is ah! Wait, no, it's not. Wait. 
Is it? Oh no, it's a woman's. Okay. Okay, Max. Retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the okay, she shredded her photo. butterfly flew in, and I took a photo. Hold on, what's going on? Hey, what hey, are you hey, doing? Hey. Okay, fire fire bell, fire bell, fire bell. I need a hammer to break it open. Oh, hurry up and hit! Oh my gosh. Tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. Right, here we go. Miss your no way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Okay, good. That did not happen. This cannot be real. Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency okay, here. He looks Leave like Miss really Caulfield weird. alone <laughs> and please turn off that alarm yeah. since that's your job. Okay, can I ever re rewind that or no? I don't even want to talk to him at this point. Hold on, Max. No. Come back here. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm. I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Okay, don't run about me. Report Nathan. All right. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Good job. Mr. Michelle. Prescott Let's happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later See? in my so office. So if you're rich, you Please get away with stuff. Please go outside with the rest of you your ain't class. ain't got no money, you, I mean, come on now, really? Of course uh, this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Should I rewind? Ooh. Because he might go he might go to that boy and say, I said da 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 da, da and he might come to me. Alright, I'm not doing it then. No, no, we're not doing it. Run it! Ooh, okay, I'm gonna ride it. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Just gonna hide the truth at this point. I just got sick in class. Um, uh, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. 
And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's Just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. Okay. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that team toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't Bruh. think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Please. Bruh. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Oh yes, my I god! Could rewind, but actually the truth. <laughs> so what do I do? Do I rewind it again? This is so stupid. See, this is why I would not have the superpower. I'm just gonna live with what I have. No, you know what? I don't care. I'm not hiding the truth. It is what it is. If he comes after me with a gun. Cause, ooh, he looks like a piece of poop, and I don't care about it. <laughs> like seriously, first of all, you ain't about to have me out here getting in trouble. Like, come on. Ooh, I should have just ran out the bathroom. I didn't think about that. Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Thank you. Oh, he's telling him to come to the front office. Okay. Alrighty. Is this first to four? Where do I go? Main building, dormitories, athletic field. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason, and I have to find out why. Okay, can I get up or are they gonna keep showing scenes of these people? Alrighty, what in the world? That was just pretty awkward. Uh, this is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody I better read Warren's text before he blows my phone up. Okay. Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse to not study, please. Uh, make sure you check out some, some, something. He talks too much. Alrighty. My mom. Happy birthday, Maxine. I can't believe it's been 18 whole years since you were brought to us. That was on the 21st of September, and I never responded. How rude. Kate. Talk to you later, Dad. Wow, so on my birthday is when they text Okay, me I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Oh, okay. Let's open my journal. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, wait a second, what was that? I've got all these cards here for people. And I will read those on my own time when I get the chance. Principal, me. Okay. 
So let's see if I can talk to this lady. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. I'm gonna say that's crazy. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms... It's a slippery slope, and it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Uh, I don't want to ask any more questions. I'm going to say you, you know, know a lot, lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. This action will have consequences. Well, I don't care because I don't need surveillance around my dorm room when I'm trying to sleep. Like, that's just not needed. Okay, who's Hayden? Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell, especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. Um... Only if you're not cool enough to get in, and it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night, then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. You mean hang with a Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. Chillax, paranoia girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Sm so, you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh, yeah, and she was hot. Okay. Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too okay, cool for us. I don't want to talk us. to this guy anymore. And I'll... Because he talks too much. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? No, but... I would love to. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Okay, she just calmed me Sorry, down. Sorry, Max. I have to focus on making sure this drone doesn't crash. Okay, let's see if there's any more people to talk to. If not, then... Wait, who is this? Talk to Justin? Yes. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh... Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Okay. Let's 
let's rewind that conversation. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? I came to Nose Slide, but I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Go for a tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. Oh, ah, oh, Let's check on treasure. Is that treasure? Trevor. Let's take a picture. Okay. Let's talk to that girl over there with the drone. See if we can uh, fix some damage. Great. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Alrighty. What's going on? Oh, now I can redo it. Let's see. Okay. Now let's talk to her about the drone. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? That looks like a high fly drone. Model B400 EVO. Now that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of energy. Okay, so going Most back in time isn't Max. really that bad. Warren and said you were multifaceted. <laughs> Here, give the drone a whirl around campus. Yeah, I actually get to fly the drone. Wait, I don't actually get to fly it, but she does at least. Alrighty, let's go to our dorm because this is kind of boring. Hey, Evan, mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Uh... Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh, my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Nope, let's redo that. Robert Capa, Robert Capa of course. I love his work, I despite right the controversy about that photo. My, yes, third time it really is this the quiet charm. child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. Okay, let's read it. These photos are great. Oh, right. And These Rachel Amber's great. face is mesmerizing. Really? I need to do all that to get the right answer? You know what? I'm leaving. What is this? I don't really care about that. It goes to dormitories. Alright, so... Come on, Logan. Bring it, bro. Yeah. Bring it, bruh. I hey need guys. to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. I will pick back up with you guys in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below any other video ideas you would like to see. And thank you once again for tuning in. Play the outro.